Essentially, MQTT is the protocol by which the messages are communicated. And it's a very popular protocol in manufacturing because of its light weightedness. By this, I mean that a message essentially doesn't have a lot of overhead. It's relatively small if you measure it in bytes. This makes it very applicable in situations where you have a limited bandwidth, either because it's a very remote location, certain plants are, or because you have a limited bandwidth with a huge amount of sensors, which can also take place on the shop floor. Now the MQTT, for this you need a central component, which we call an MQT broker. And an MQT broker is, as I've explained earlier, the component that makes sure that messages are collected and can be read from by the various producers and consumers. Note that the message broker is not meant for long-term storage. We will get to this point in a future video.